What's up guys, it's Prime here. Uh, I know it's been like another 10, 11 months, almost a year since that last minute video. Um, it has been a while, but I hope all of you guys have been doing very well for yourselves. And I hope you guys took something from my last video and hopefully you guys understood where I was coming from on each side of that. So I appreciate you guys all for watching that video. I'm not sure when you guys are watching this video, but about a week or two ago when I'm making this video, uh, I got hacked. I'm not sure if you guys noticed, but there was like a video uploaded of like a YouTube tutorial on how to download Premiere Pro and obviously that was not me. Um, I got a virus um, downloading some software. Maybe you guys know what kind of software, but moral of the story is that wasn't me and be careful what you download because you guys can get hacked just like I did. But thankfully I got it back so that's all resolved so we can just move past that. But in today's video guys, I'm just going to be showing you guys an updated gaming set of video. It's still nothing too insane to be quite honest but it's getting better over, over the time and you know, I'm slowly improving it and I'm slowly buying things as you know, as I start to earn more money just working at my jobs, uh, you know, obviously I'm going to have the funds to buy stuff so now I'm just slowly upgrading my setup, slowly but surely. Uh, it's never too late, I guess, but yeah. Just a quick disclaimer, this video is sponsored by Govi. All right guys, sorry for the pause in the video, but I just wanna make a quick disclaimer to you guys. The box did not come like this. Um, after watching the video and after editing it, I realized that it looks like it came like this and it didn't come like this. I just wanted to clear that up. There were some complications at home that kind of caused the box to look like this. I don't really wanna get into the details. It's nothing crazy, but um, yeah. So I just wanted to point that out to you guys. So hopefully you guys understand them. Um, yeah, back to the video. Thanks. They were kind enough to send me this light strip. And as you guys know, maybe you guys know, I'm not sure if you guys do. Hopefully you guys do know. I love my LED strips. I have one in the back and this is actually their product right here. So that was pretty cool when they reached out to me that they wanted to send me this product and they wanted me to review it. So I was more than happy to do that. So hopefully you guys do enjoy this review video. Just a little quick segment of it. The cool thing about these lights, it's RGBIC, which is a brand new type of LED light. And Govi is the one that's mainly pushing this out. They have a lot of cool products. And obviously I'm already using one, which I bought about a year ago already. And the cool thing that they're offering right now is a discount for the RGB neon light switch. And they're offering a great deal for that. On the screen will be the link. And the link will also be in the description if you guys want to check that out. Make sure you guys check out the link in the description below uh, for the promotion deal that they're doing of the neon rgb ic light switch i'm still getting used to the brand new name for the rgb ic but hopefully you guys and hopefully everyone will start to use these lights in the near future as you know it's the brand new thing and it's really cool for those that are confused and don't know what rgb ic is it's basically a new type of led light which basically displays different sections all in one strip so pretty much this can be blue that can be red that can be orange and so on you guys can get the idea or on the other hand it can be like a regular mode uh led light where it can just display one color at the same time which is what i usually like to rock but i'm gonna test this product out the product that they sent me out is the rope light so it's a type of light that allows you to make cool designs on a wall or something the idea i have is to put it around this poster if it fits correctly hopefully that fits around the poster so i can make this look pretty cool and i'm really excited to use this product i'm gonna unbox this for you guys real quickly i'll give you guys a little time lapse of me unboxing it and me setting it up potentially and then i'll show you guys the final product of how it looks hopefully there if not then i'm gonna figure out where i want to put this and then i'm gonna be sure to show you guys exactly where i put that and i'm most likely gonna be using the rainbow color effect on this one as that's the most popular option and that's what i also like a lot as well as the solid color as well obviously all right so i'm about to unbox this right now it comes with uh some clip hangy things so it obviously doesn't fall off the wall that's what i use so that doesn't fall off the wall and it's done a really good job so far the past year i've had that strip and it obviously comes with a little more of them and then we get the general uh light uh port whatever you want to call this the thing that actually makes the thing work and then they also give you more clip hangy things so obviously the strip doesn't fall off so this is going to be very good and very helpful to ensure it doesn't fall off and then we obviously have the strip itself 
This is a cool type of strip. How I said, this is the Dolby LED neon rope lights. And keep in mind, this is RGB IC, which is better than RGB. I promise you guys. Wait till you guys see until I set this up. It's gonna be really cool. I'm gonna make it really short and sweet for you guys. So yeah. All right, guys. So it's the next day. Um, the reason why it took me until the next day to film this last part of the video is because I just had to figure out exactly what I wanted to put on the wall. But I figured it out, and I really like how it came out. I got my family to help me out, so they were really helpful with that. So thank you to my family if you are watching this. I'm sure you guys are. So here's the final product. Uh, hopefully you guys can read what that says. Maybe not. Um, you know, I'm obviously not the most creative person ever, but it says Prime. So hopefully you guys could read that. Leave me a comment down below what I should change or if I should, you know, do something to make it look a little better. To make it say Prime better, you know, obviously. But yeah, so this is basically what the LED lights do. How I said, this is RGB IC, so it, it does many cool effects in one whole strip. And obviously, regular RGB can't do that. If I go on the app right here, I can control the lights I have. So basically, if I go on this current line strip, which is obviously the rope light I have. There are many different effects. Uh, I currently have it on the rainbow effect. I like the rainbow effect a lot. I think it really makes the room pop out a lot, but there's many different options like star. We have uh, an aurora. We have lightning. We have Meteor Show. This one's pretty cool. I checked this one out earlier. No, you can choose from so many options. You can imagine, man. Like, there's so many. So that's the cool thing about the RGBIC rope lights that they sent me out. Uh, I really do appreciate it. Once again, for sending it out. Um, you know, these are really cool. And I really do recommend these products because it just makes your room look a lot cooler. And how I said, it doesn't have to say like a certain thing. It doesn't have to do anything. It's whatever you want it to be and however you want it. I've even seen people put it up on their ceiling, which is also really cool. Uh, they put it up on their wall, make a cool design like a guitar or something like that. In general, it's your own design however you want to make it. That's the whole purpose of this light strip. Uh, it's whatever you decide to do with it. And once again, this is what I do with it. Once again, I have the rainbow effect, my favorite effect. This is one I recommend to use. I like it a lot. And then if we take a little quick close up, we can see how the light transforms into many different colors. And obviously how I said RGB can't do that, but RGB I see. Yeah. So now onto the actual gaming studio video what all you guys are waiting for I'll keep it short and simple for you guys to make it as easy as possible for you guys to look at So when we walk in the room, I have this trippy red poster. Um, I don't know why I saw this up I'm gonna change it eventually. Um, I have a mirror here. You guys can see me. Don't look at me This is a quick little overview of how the room looks in general So this is what you will see when you walk in my room and when you just stand in it obviously So if I go on this left side, you see this big shelf full of stuff. I have a box the laptop I bought I have a cool little painting that my sister painted for me. I really like it. It's really sweet uh, Supreme bottle don't recommend buying that my graduation year 2022 because I'm graduating high school in about two three weeks Which is crazy to think about here I have some books and a box for a chain that I bought um, I have a Lonzo Ball Funko Pop if you guys know me very well You know, I'm a big Lonzo Ball fan and Lonzo Ball is everything to me to be honest I had this cool little thing. I'm not sure what it's called, but a friend gave it to me And I really like how it looks there and I think it fits really well with the whole room And I also have some ties here and the thing that goes in a tie I bought this for my mock trial I haven't used it ever since but I will use it for my graduation eventually if we go here We have some uh, cologne Gucci and if I go here again, we have some Dior I recommend this one very much to you guys So here I have my safe as well And then I have some shoe boxes at the bottom of this section And then I also have this box of an extractor for I extract the carpet out of my car and make a cleaner and that's basically what I do with it. I have a soccer cabinet. Uh, nothing too crazy. Uh, that's how it looks like. That's just something for my bed. Uh, obviously that doesn't belong there. Some cool shirts, you know, some trophies, favorite soccer team shirt. Um, and yeah. So then when I open my uh, closet, uh, obviously this is a real life view of it. I have all the boxes I've ever bought from stuff. Um, it's kind of hard to see because it is kind of dark, but this is a quick overview of like everything I've ever bought. I have my camera box, my razor box, AirPods, Dior, Dior, uh, headsets, iPhones, you name it, Audio Technica, there's everything in here. And then I obviously have my clothes here. Uh, it's usually color sorted, but it's been a while since I've been at home really. Um, I don't really have time nowadays, so I will do that eventually, but in this video, I'm gonna keep it raw, you guys. So here I have my bed. Um, I usually have an LED strip going here. It is still there, but it doesn't work anymore. It broke, so I'm gonna have to buy some new ones. Maybe buy one of these or so, put it right under there, make it look really cool. And then here I have an Ugg blanket. Uh, this thing is the softest thing ever. If you guys don't have one of these, I highly recommend it. You guys need to get yourself one of these. They're so comfy. So that's the bed. And here I have a Lonzo Ball jersey. How I said, I love Lonzo Ball a lot. Um, uh, no homo. I got it signed by three players, thankfully. I got DeMar DeRozan's signature. I got Derrick Jones Jr., the guy who knows how to dunk really well. And then I got Vucevic. 
Uh, those are pretty cool. Uh, they're really cool dudes. Damar was the nicest one for sure. He's a real stand up dude and you know, I respect this game and my God, he should be the MVP in my opinion, but that's just me. I was gonna film a vlog for that game that I went to in August. Uh, it was the Pelicans versus the Bulls, obviously. First game of the regular season. I just wanted to enjoy the moment, so that's why I didn't film it, but I was really close to doing it, but I didn't. So here I have a quick overview of my desk setup, I guess. Uh, here I have the laptop that I use. This thing's a monster. I'll put the specs up on the screen right now for you guys if you guys are interested. Um, I have my burner phone now, my old iPhone. Uh, this is the dock I use for the laptop that I connect to these monitors right here. So basically all I gotta do is connect those cables right there into this little dock and then it will boot it all up and then all this will be working. So I'll basically have the monitors working, the mic, the keyboard, the mouse, you name it. And then here I have some pencils and then I have some of uh, my favorite candy. Uh, if you guys know me very well, once again, you guys know I love my chocolate Tootsie Pops. These things I cannot live without. And then here I have my YouTube plaques. Look at that view right there. That view is just very beautiful. Beautiful. And then here I have some stickers that I've collected over the years. Uh, I have a goat one. I have my friend's brand, Do More. Uh, if you guys want to check that out, I'll put that also in the description. Uh, I know he tries really hard on it, so I'll give him a little shout out. Here I have some G Fuel stickers, EGL, Soar, EGL, Elevate, Soar, Mischief, Razor, Turtle Beach. And then here I have a picture of my sister's quinceanera of me. Uh, that was a really fun party and, you know, it was really cool. And then here I obviously have my Xbox One S. Um, I'm not ever going to upgrade this ever again. Um, I don't think I'll ever buy a new Xbox or new console. PC is the way to go now. I'm hoping to buy a new desktop really soon. Hopefully in the next week or two or three maybe. I'm not sure. It just depends on how everything goes. And then here I obviously have my clutch chair. Uh, this company has done me so well over the past two, three years. Um, it's kind of tearing up a little bit right there, unfortunately, but hey, that happens with time and with uh, good use and stuff like that. So obviously I haven't putting it to use, but uh, yeah. And then here I have some storage compartments. Uh, I have my games and then and storage storage and then um, that's basically it uh, nothing too crazy this is what the room will look like when it's lit at night and when the lights are all shut off I also have some LED light bulbs right there that change colors uh, I don't have them on right now I don't really want to have them on right now but this is basically what my room is gonna look like at night and when all the lights are shut off and this strip really just adds justice like the camera does not do justice on how well this looks in real life um, it looks insane in real life you guys gotta cop yourself one of these but yeah this is basically my room tour uh, I didn't want to make it too long for you guys i wanted to keep it short and simple for you guys because obviously i get it long videos are not the move nowadays that's just how i look at it personally but yeah i appreciate all you guys for watching this video i really do um if you guys want me to post a car tour video i definitely can do that within the next week or two uh because i know people did want to see that video when i posted my last video about why i quit youtube so if you guys do want to see that please let me know leave a comment down below saying car tour video car anything like that just so i know you guys do want to see that obviously but yeah once again i really do appreciate all you guys for watching this video uh it means the world to me and i hope all you guys have been doing well and safe once again and uh i appreciate you guys taking time out of your day to watch this um you know i know people are really busy nowadays and i get it so just taking a couple minutes out of your day it means a lot to me but all right guys i'll leave you guys to it and i hope to see you guys in the next video hopefully very soon hopefully within the next week or two just let me know in the comments below but all right guys till next time i'll see you guys later peace out guys